This conference will now be recorded. As this user is having the procurement capability, let's see how to create purchase orders. Click on this procurement icon, go to this purchase order option, then go to the task, and then click on the create order. We have two options, generate order and create order. Generate order is a process. We need to submit it and we need to select the requisition and all. So I will let you know later, but now let's create an order. Click on this create order link. It will give you that which style you want to create as a purchase order, blanket order, whatever style you want to select, you can select. Select the procurement view, requisitioning view, and the supplier. Let's say something ABC. ABC consulting and its supplier side, supplier contact, and ship to and who is the buyer. Just press this create button and you will be landed on the PO creation page. Here you can select the options such as buyer managed transport, request signature, any terms you want to change. These are the things that we have selected on that create option page. Now we need to add some lines. So let me add one line. Just press this plus button and line type what you want to keep item if you want to select the inventory item i'm just taking this expense item descriptive item i'm just taking a test item i'm giving a category let's see computer something then quantity i'm giving three unit of measure each and price basis I will give as in let's say five and then location I need to give this schedule I need by date comes in schedule let's say it's a month day and year format so today let's say second just i've given the state distribution charge account i need to give as i don't have any charge account on my employee so it has not been defaulted let's search anything and then select one and then press ok so now i will just press the save button and i can submit or approval i will receive a message that this purchase order 163818 was submitted for approval i can just press ok and just to see whether it has been approved or not i can go to manage order section and here i can see i can just give the filter that buyer my user just press the search button so i have yes i have two orders Early I have created one and this is the one which I created now and it's in open status that means it's approved so in next video we will see how to receive the orders